subscribe to my youtube channel Konde boy 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 Today on the show we have an international superstar by the name Harmonize how are you doing Cool. Cool. Thank you. Okay, uh, glad to have you here. Um, anytime I'm interviewing someone for the first time, I always like to ask them where they get their name from. Because I know Harmonize isn't your real name. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so yeah, where did where did Harmonize come from? Well, my real name is Harmon uh, Raja. Right. Raja Abdukhari Ibrahim. That's my real name. So that's my real name. So back in the days, I was saying and now uh, one of her career. Uh, Well, Lagos is cool. Lagos is cool. Just enjoying the jewel fries, you know, to link up with new people every day, just to get the new experience. That's it. Okay, cool. Yeah. Uh, so we're going to look at a couple of songs on your playlist right now. Uh, yeah. Can you name just two songs off the list that you have? Well, first of all, just want to say I'm a fan. I'm a biggest fan of Nigerian music because Nigeria, Nigeria is like the center of African music. So I'm a fan of Nigerian music. So I listen a lot of Nigerian music. So the song that I listen back to back, uh, number one is uh, Amisi Bad Bad. It's uh, me, Mr. Easy, and Bad Boy. Okay. And, uh, why do you like that song? Uh, because I love feeling. I love feeling. I love to, to dedicate songs. Even most of my songs, inspiration songs. So I love feeling. Okay. Let's take another song. So, um, number two, Kill Them Sha. <laughs> Kill Them but Banner Boy. Uh, I love the vibe, I love the energy, you know. Banner is a bad guy, you know. <laughs> so, I love the vibe. Yeah. Alright, so you grew up in Tanzania. Yeah, yeah. What Tanzania. was that like? What was growing up like? Um, first of all, I was born in Tuara. Tuara is the south of Tanzania. So, I was born there. Then I started. Primary school and second, then I came to Dar es Salaam. Then it was like um, 10 years ago, I came to Dar es Salaam. Yeah, so I was just on the street. Then I tried to look myself like I didn't have that perfect education, so what I'm going to do. I tried to pray for school. You know? Then I used to sing, but it wasn't that proper. But I started to sing professionally. Like six, six years ago. Yeah. Okay, so that's how you stepped into music. Yeah, yeah. Wow, that's fantastic. Um, can you tell us something about the Tanzanian culture that is just beautiful? Well, we got beautiful with you. You heard about Zanzibar? Zanzibar is crazy. <laughs> if you've been Zanzibar, <laughs> Zanzibar is like, what are you talking about Zanzibar? It's like Miami in America. Yeah, so culture, beautiful. People, so many people from different countries come with summer, you know, from Europe, people from America, from different angles of the world, they come to Tanzania, call of Tanzania, so we're proud of that. And but the another thing is peaceful, Tanzania is peaceful. Okay, so let's take two more songs of your list. Well, um, I don't know the real name, but I know to sing that song. Cause my baba no be down, go de 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 a de de de. My name is Tenny, Tenny, right? I love the vibe. It just sounds different. I love it. Okay. Yeah. Another song. Yeah, another song is Tetema by Diamond and Tetema by Raven and Diamond. Tanzania. It's like number one song at the moment right now. Yeah. Just there, just drop it like what we can go over almost like six million viewers right now on YouTube, so it's crazy. Yeah. All right, we, we still have Harmonize in the studio with us for Superstar 10. Make sure you join the conversation on Twitter, it's hashtag Superstar 10. And if you have anyone in mind you'd love to uh, get on the show, just send us a message and we'll make that happen for you. Now, right back to you, uh, Harmonize. I need you to list um, some people, let's say two or three, uh, some musicians who have heavily influenced your music. 
Boom. First is Bob Marley. Okay. What's your favorite Bob Marley song? One of Okay. <laughs> Among the Marleys right now, do you have a favorite? <laughs> Sorry? Among the Marleys right now, uh, Damian, Steven, do you have a favorite Marley right now? Yeah, yeah, yeah Steven Marley. Okay. And... Um, so, what's the first Nigerian song you ever heard? The first song? Yeah. I remember the first oh Nigerian song. Oh my god, you yes. Heard. The first song, it was. You are my African queen, the girl of my dream. You take me where I've never been. You make my heart sing a ring a ring. Oh, I remember back in the days I was cool. I was like, yo, this is my favorite song. <laughs> yeah. hey, that's my favorite song. That's my first song. Then, then I remember the time. Then um, P Square, you know, yeah. Jeff Martin. Okay. okay, that's cool. Okay, let's look at your playlist. What's on there? Give us another song. Okay, well, another song. Um, another song is that for me. That for me. Vanessa Day. That for me. Vanessa, she's queen. She's doing well. East Africa. Yeah. All that right. For me. That song is that for me. It's nice. Jump. Besides music and football, which you mentioned, is there any other thing that you like doing, especially when it's time to relax? What do you do to relax? I like to swim. A lot. Are you a very good swimmer or just a chill type? Well, I'm very good swimmer. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Do you have any cooking skills? No. We're trying to sell you up in here. So, uh, do you have any cooking skills, dancing skills? Mm, maybe dancing skills. Maybe dancing. Yeah. How do you rate yourself in dancing on a scale of one to ten? I'm not that. I'm not that professional. I'm just trying sometimes. You know, if or uh, if I'm just feeling bored, I just dance. You know. Yeah. Just to vibe, to vibe myself. It's not like I'm a professional dancer. I don't dance now. And, uh, do you know the new Nigerian dance move called Zanku? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you do, do that? I can do it. <laughs> I can do it. Yeah, that means you're good now. That's no, the thing is, the thing is, the thing is, that that one is more popular. So everybody, he wants to know how to dance. So I took it myself, like one week during that <laughs> during Zanku. <laughs> yeah. So now I can. <laughs> can kill them. <laughs> Alright. Yeah. Okay, so let's look at your playlist. Uh, give us more songs from your playlist. Well, um, uh, number six is uh, Yawa by Sisu Mel. Bro, I love Sisu Mel. He's so talented, man. Yawa is like my best song. I've been listening to that song back to back. How do you feel about being nominated for an award back in uh, January? Remember the MVPs who were nominated? Yeah, yeah. How was that? Yeah, I was I was feeling so good because I was I had like three nominations and it's amazing to me. Um, so I was feeling so good. I can't stop to thank God and my fans for and Sound City to put me on that map. But that was map because. I was the same category with Banner Boy, Damo, Whiskey, David, all the same category. So it was really good thing to me because I just, I just started like a few years ago. So if you put me on that map, no matter how I do, no matter how, no matter how big I am, no matter how I work, I work a lot. But to put me on that, on that category, automatically I feel like I'm a winner. Did you do a song with Shay Shay? Yeah, yeah, Shay Shay featuring Harmonizes, Komaro, and the video is coming soon. I think it should be the 1st of March. How did that happen? Well, I went to America. I went to America. I think it was Atlanta. So I met I met one of her management. That told me, like, we just only want you to jump on it. So I was there. Then I recorded that song in America. Alright. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so let's take a couple of songs off your list. Um, uh, number seven is Fever by Whiskey. I love the song, you know, it's just cool. You know, when I want to relax and you know, put my mind, to cool my temper down. Okay. Another one? Another one is uh, Sensima, and then go let the air, but look at this, so get the air, but you can never forget. Why, why, go? Why, you let the air, like, send the air. That is mad. That is You've been vibing to a lot you know, of Nigerian music. Yeah, you know, that song is, uh, that song is popular just to be out, man. You know, even if you go to the crowd. Thank you.
Okay, so you have Afro Bongo out now. Yeah. It's a four track EP. Yeah. Uh, why did you decide to do that? Well, first of all, I had, a, uh, I had a project with Yemi and it's so easy, but when I texted Bama and told him, like, yo, bro, I want to work with you, he said, yeah, cool, man, we can do it. I know you, I was in Kenya. He, he was in Kenya for the show, come to Lagos so that we can we can vibe more. By the time he was in London, he told me we exactly the So I came up. So when we met for the first time, we like, just came to, you know, in time we just vibe, vibe, vibe. So we got more track with Ivana. So our idea was to top like EP. Me and just me and him, like five songs, because we got, we got like five track me and So the idea